guys what's up it's your girl lady review back to you with another video this video is about canceling your service with dish and returning their equipment to them okay so we decided to switch from dish to direct tv yeah direct tv with at&t to bundle and everything because dish didn't have the um, internet as well for our area so we decided to switch so we've been with them uh for about one or three years i think it was so we were well outside of our contract and everything like that so we have fulfilled our contract we're good so if you're good with them it's pretty easy to get their stuff back to them but one thing they do want you to do is send their equipment back like the hopper and the joy so anyway they'll send you this box once you call them and tell them they give you 30 days, I think it's like 30 days, to return them their equipment without any charges. So, here's the box, dish box. They'll send you a big, pretty big size box. Let's see if you can see this. It's a pretty big size box, okay? So you can return all the equipment. All right, here's the sheet where they tell you how to, uh, or what all should be included in here and what shouldn't, okay? I think if you're not in your contract, some things you, they gonna want, they gonna demand you to send back. Some things not. And I think if you're in a house versus an apartment, we're in an apartment, so some things that they don't require us to send back. All right, here's the sheet. And it says up there at the top, please return all dish equipment immediately to avoid none return charges up to $149 per LNBF and $299 per receiver. For your convenience, a prepaid return shipping label has been included. They did send the shipping label as well. Now, the LBNF is number three. That's this right here. That's on That's on your, um, can you see it? This thing right here, number three. Uh, it's on your satellite dish. And I think this is too, number four. That is called the node. It's on your your satellite as well but she asked me she said um is it dangerous for you to get and i was like yeah so anyway she didn't require me to do it we're outside our contract so we're good all right inside the box you can see it they have two trays two trays this tray it's a tray right here as well okay <clears throat> inside of here trying to get you to see it it has a holder for the remotes see the remotes are all in there this is the hopper with the cord in there you have to make sure that that's in there they give you a bag for the hopper big enough tray and if you have their wireless uh, internet box they want that and you put that right there whatever plugs or whatever come with it <clears throat> all right and that's the bottom tray the hopper goes on the bottom tray because it's heavier with all the remotes and then the top tray has your joeys so we had two joeys we had one hopper and two joeys and the joeys are placed right here along with the plugs and on the plugs Go ahead and get like the uh, wrapper for the um, bread, the tie for the bread. Put that on there. That's what I did. We had some extras. So set that in there and set the jewelry on top of there. I got two of them. So make sure you return them all their plugs. <clears throat> all right. So everything is in here ready to go. All I have to do is slap the return shipping label on. Um, yeah, put the box back together and everything and, um, tape it up and because I'm not near, um, a UPS store, usually if I was near a UPS store, I could drop it off, no charge, but because I'm not, I have to take it to a post office and they're, they're going to charge me 12 bucks to ship it on to back to, um, dish. And make sure that, hold on a second. <clears throat> I 
there's a return shipping label make sure that you um, put uh, record the uh, tracking number once you get it and everything because well, they're going to scan and everything they'll give you a return sh I mean uh, a tracking label so the dish can track it as well as I can track it to make sure it gets there gets where it's supposed to go okay so I want to talk about one thing about uh, dish we really loved it we really enjoyed it hate to get rid of it but the bill was getting out of hand we were paying like 140 some a month that's ridiculous and paying 88 dollars for for um internet as well so we decided to uh, just you know combine everything with AT&T which is a whole lot cheaper okay so uh, this is a tip quick tip uh, if you're wanting a better deal with your cable company your internet company whoever phone company I don't care if you want a better deal with them call and ask call and tell them that you want to cancel your service you tell them you want to cancel your service they go to laying out the red carpet offering you like 50 bucks difference on your bill anything to get you to stay so if you want to lower your service call and tell them that you want to cancel it because they're gonna say why you want to cancel it ma'am or whatever ma'am or sir um well, think about going with somebody with a better deal. They may ask you, well, what are they offering? Oh, they offering to give me cable for $10. What you get? <laughs> but yeah, they will um, offer you uh, a drop on your bill. I mean, Dish was asking, uh, uh, offering us like 25 bucks off our bill a month. Then told us, they told us at first that uh, they would charge us what we initially signed up for the price that you know after two years they changed the price on you so they said that they would give us that so that's what you do if you want to lower your bill call and ask them even our internet we had to drop our internet and uh they offered to take our bill down like 40 bucks so quick tip do that lower your bill don't be paying them out the ass for all this stuff that they got it's just ridiculous how much they charge for some of this stuff it's ridiculous but we did love Dish. Hate to see them go. Direct TV is okay. I don't like it. <laughs> but hey, it's, we're we're saving a hundred bucks. So why not? Deuces, Dish. And you're out of there. I'm backing you up, buddy. All right, guys. I wanted to make this video to um, help those who um, are about to or thinking about. Um, dropping their dish service on what you can expect they're they're pretty cool with it oh and another tip if you're going to drop their service you tell them that you're moving and you're not sure that you're going to get um you know whatever cable or internet yet so tell them that and sometimes uh if you if you tell them that you're leaving going to another company they'll try to add some charges on you they'll try to add some bullshit charges on you so tell them that you're moving don't tell them that you're going with another service or whatever and you can tell them that you're going with another service if you're not really thinking about dropping them but you're just thinking about it just call them tell them hey i'm thinking about dropping y'all y'all got some better deals that's different but if you're really really gonna drop them tell them that you're moving best tip ever all right guys i'm about to go in this video if you have any questions or concerns or you know you don't know what's going on um drop a comment below and i'll be able to uh, hopefully i'll be able to help you all with it so yep that's it for this video i'll see you in the next one Deuces.